uh, there in this video I'm gonna explain you uh, how you can add the failure conditions to the build in team stream so if you go to the build configuration page uh, for any build you will find on the left hand side this link failure conditions so uh, in this uh, page what you can do is you can uh, specify like uh, when the build should be marked as fail build so by default uh, the team city marks or fails the build if build process exit code is uh, not zero or at least one of the tests is failed uh, or out of memory or the crash is detected so all this uh, th these are default settings so whenever uh, any of this uh, happens that build is marked as fail build and apart from that you can also add the external customized failure conditions so for example if you want to fail the build uh, when a specific text is found in the build log you can select this particular fail failure condition and you can give here the text that you want to search in the build log so if this particular text is found in the build log that particular build will be failed and you can also give the failure message on this and another failure condition that you can add is uh, you can fail the build when uh, some matrix changes for example there are lots of a lot of matrix for example if you want to fail the build if artifact size is uh, more than a specified uh, size say for example uh, one 100 MB or 200 MB if the artifact size is more than that the build will be failed and similarly you can uh, have number of uh, different uh, metrics like uh, if there are a number of classes is more than a specified number of classes build will be failed then build duration if the build takes a lot of time say for example uh, more than 10 minutes you can fail the build using this particular setting and you can also uh, specify like number of fail tests say for example if you want to fail the build only if there are a uh, number of fail tests are more than or equal to 10 then you can uh, use this particular metric and there are uh, various other types of uh, failure uh, metrics that you can use uh, to fail the build so that's how you can manage the failure conditions uh, for the build in team 3 if you like this video hit like button thank you